technical difficulty there. But, um, but yeah, the freaking, there we go, we had to rotate it. So if you see another live video up there, just ignore it. I'm just trying to get this video done here. I gotta get us locked in here. Seems like every time you wanna do videos, there's disruption somewhere along the damn lines. But what we're gonna be working on today is a Zoe DVR. I haven't got the cameras hooked up yet. Well, I got them all installed, but I'm just waiting on my power supply to get her tomorrow. It's a surge protector so I can plug everything in. All I'm gonna do today is just replace the 3.5 SATA HDD hard disk drive in it, which is word for hard disk HDD to uh, and it's not gonna take memory in it. I'm putting a one terabyte team group in it, 3D NAND, six gigabytes S SATA SLC extra large solid state drive in it, three year warranty. Okay, and I'll do a review on this once I get it done. Now, I don't know if I can use this um, install kit. That's like for another kind of a SATA, like for a 3.5 or 2.5, but it come free with it. I paid about 50 some bucks for the kit. So now we're live. Um, first thing we got to do is remove the cover, which is a number one bit. Or a number two, rather, actually, it's a number one. I'm um, right there, and I'm using a power driver, so it don't back one on the left, one on the right. Then you got one right here on the very side, right here, where you see I'm doing at where the screwdriver is. It's a great driver, by the way. I did a review on it at the trailer. Okay, one thing about these, um. I won't be able to test nothing today until tomorrow until UPS gets here if they get my power strip out of Columbus. I got a power strip behind the TV, but DC voltage boxes hog up a lot of room, especially if they're big boxes. So that's why I ordered a new one. And that's the hard drive, guys. You can buy your Zoe's with or without a hard drive. I chose with. Um, and it's a desktop hard drive, basically a 2.5 SATA. And there's four screws on the bottom. We're just going to bounce these out here. I just got to get my bit locked in. Once you to pull the collar up. And get it down in there. Actually push it down and slide it in. There we go. Just lay the screws there. If we don't need those, we'll just bounce them right back in the old hard drive. And I will do a review once that comes in. It'll probably be three to five days before I do a review. I want to make sure. And But like any other hard drive, um, like an SD card, solid state, whatever drive you use, SD card, um, thumb drive, you know, USB thumb drives, always make sure you format the darn things. But one good thing about a hard drive for these, or like a computer, these don't take like windows or any operating system you just throw them in and format them basically is all you do so we're going to plug these couple of connectors right there that's the cell state that's a 2 point or 3.5 the only way these will work on a laptop if you have a sata plug via usb to do it or like a hard drive case via usb these will work in a desktop. Now, these, on the other hand, will work in a laptop or a desktop. These are only a desktop type. So this is the team group here. Uh, all right, drive it. I'm, I'm packaging it up for you. Oh, looks good already, Lacey. Oh, I like you. Uh, right there. <laughs> I don't buy cheap, junky hard drives. It's fake storage. 
And this here is my kit. And it does come with the screws, I think. The hard drive screws, I'm not for sure. I think these are like uh, M2, M3 like screws. Maybe M4, but I know they're metric. But you can also, you can always Google search what you need. I do have screws here for PCs and stuff, so, um, so I got like a box of them. Let me see if this is gonna set down in here. If not, cause this will help raise it up a little bit. If not, I ain't worried about it. I was fast a darn hard drive like it's supposed to. Let's see here, move these cables out. If not, I'll mount it flush to the bottom here. Let's see here. It probably just have to be mounted flush because the screw holes ain't lining up. But. I'm not worried. I am not worried whatsoever. Just throw my screws out there because I'll sort them out from them on my bed anyhow. I get the right screws here. That was at least silver ones, okay. So you want to use like these little pan head silver ones, okay. So we're gonna. Try to get this lined up. We're gonna plug the wires in. Now the wires you ain't gonna get messed up. The red one goes like this. Okay. And this multicolored plug will go like this. Only it goes in one way, so you're not gonna get them backwards. And I'm just gonna start the screws here, line this up here. I'll probably start the screws by hand. And tighten them up once we go here. Let's go. Alright. Yep, I got the right screw holes. I'm just gonna to kind of start them a little bit by hand. Just so I can get them laced nailed. Okay. Let me start a couple. I think they're like M3, M4s. But don't quote me on it, guys. Uh, you might, you could look up on Google or eBay. Just look up hard drive screws. But I do know they're metric threaded, so. So, you know, they're metric. And it's just four. Oh, hey guys. Bro, Bo, what does that wire do? I fixed those too. You are a boss. Can you review ghost energy? I, I tried. I, I must wait till summer to do some of those videos outside because right now I'm behind until. Uh. March the 12th, I'm trying to find Creamer because he's like every time you want to find him. Oh, the weather has to get bad. Oh, we got to get cold for the day. He don't have to be extremely tight. You know, you just lift it up like so and then just make sure they're just zap tight enough. 
Boom, boom. Boom. And boom. And that's it for the hard drive install, guys. Now we do tuck these wires back down under. And we put our little case cover back on. Now you can buy these at 4 DVR, like 8, Crypt, or freaking 16. Zozy would be the only one I'd buy. And it don't come from a regular seller. It comes from Zozy Direct um, through eBay or their website. Okay. So basically, this way you get right from the dealer, right from the manufacturer, and you know you get the right equipment without getting ripped off. That's how I order my spare cameras if I need them. Um, extra cable cords. Um, and they do send you off from time to time emails with like their discount stuff on it. Like, uh, um, like so much off of your order. So, yeah, I'm just getting the screw started and I'm going to bang them in with this electric driver here. I got another tech video doing, um... Next month when I get the kit in, and that's a, a whole screen replacement on a, oh shit, a screen replacement on um a cell phone I'm doing. Glad that screw just fell right down here. Uh, it's a Moto G Power 2021. You can't really tell if it's cracked or not. Not unless you really look at it by the sunlight, but it's cracked some, so I'm going to replace the whole damn screen. Um, so I'm going to be doing a tech video on that. And Lacey put her own hard drive in the other day in her computer. I showed her, taught her how to do it. Um, in case anything ever happened to me or if I was ever sick or something and couldn't do it. Um, her one hinge on her laptop computer broke literally off the damn cover. And I had to draw it back on. So I'm going to have a tech video coming up. Maybe in May. Of stripping our whole computer out. Because everything from your circuit board. Motherboard. Everything is all hooked to the keyboard. And I got to wait to get the money for the keyboard. That's like 60 some freaking dollars. So I'll probably be doing a tech video on that. But yeah. This here is a Zozy. HD digital video recorder. It's Z O S I. Okay. And that's all your camera ports. Like I said, there's 18 of them. Bunch of other attachments. Mainly all I use is power adapter, the Ethernet, and the camera plug is all I use. I and one HDMI cable. I'd be good. But there's your video. I will be good because I was going to be a wise ass. There's your video on the team group. Uh, how to change a hard drive. We, we basically want from this big guy, okay, heavy ass big guy, to one of these thin ones, okay. That adds less weight to your thing. Plus, solid state is a lot faster than um, even an HDD. And what HDD means hard disk drive because there's a disk and moving parts inside this where this is just the case built around a circuit board okay so i told you i wouldn't take long to change for a tech video i was gonna be wise because you said sozy yeah well that's the name of it i was yeah you said sozy i was gonna say mosey yeah that is the name of it the company but yeah, when you got extra screws like me, always keep them because you never god darn know when you're going to need one, okay? Um, Because I got a whole box of them right here I bought from eBay. Good company, by the way. Got different M types and like M1 all the way through M3 slice 14. I mean, they're in Ziploc bags, so they're all there. But anyhow, guys, I'm going to rock out of here, and I got one more product review to do here in a bit after I take a break. We get this put in, but tomorrow, all I got to do is plug this in to the power, adjust the cameras, and format 
the hard drive. Like I said, anytime you do a hard drive, SD card, thumb drive, whatever, you always format it. But like a computer, you got to um, create a petition, a petition letter, and format the hard drive before you can put the operating system in a computer. This, on the other hand, there's no operating system. Just format, you're good to go. But anyhow, guys, it's been my pleasure. I'm doing a tech video. I got two more coming up. Um, they'll be probably long ones, a whole cell phone re screen replacement and a keyboard replacement for Lacey's computer. Although I am going to go on eBay after we get a car and order two extra laptops, have them set up and ready in case anything happens to these. Because I just got out of show place finally. I got my toolbox finally paid off the other day. Finally paid off. I own it. My laptop's been owned since November. So I don't have no rent dough no more. And that's what I'm trying to stay about, not to rent dough no more. For a long time. Because once you get in there, you can't get out sometimes. Um, but anyhow, guys, thanks for watching. You've seen your tech in action. You want the best, come to my channel. Over a lot of tech support people because I go live. They just sometimes upload. I've done that before until yeah. I got enough subscribers to do yeah. it on my phone. That's me and all my phone. Everything back on. Okay, what's that? I oh. was going to hook oh, everything yeah. back up. But there you go, guys. There's your laptop. But yeah, laptop. All right. Here's Zozy tech video. I promise you want the best. You see the rest. Come to this tech. Um, I'll get you hooked up every time, guys. Um, but anyhow. See you in the next two tech videos, but I do got a product review coming up today. You'll be happy I did this video. But I got to get my computer up, updated, make sure there ain't no updates, and I'll come back to you live. But anyhow, guys, I'm going to get out of my tripod here. Yeah. But anyhow, guys, there you go. Please reach, reach the secret. Yeah, this is amazing. You're welcome, guys. Uh, anyhow... I'll see you in the next ones. Roll it soon. I got a tech video due next month on a phone, a phone re screen replacement. And when I can get Lacey's keyboard later, I got to do that for you. Well, yeah, she has to figure out the cables, which ones are which, because we got a mark, but I couldn't do it up there in front of the TV like I wanted because we had them in a cubby hole. <laughs> but it's better if I did it out in the open, you know, where I could do it better. But anyhow, guys, See you in the next one. Bye, guys.